Based on scripture and apostolic tradition, the Catholic Church teaches that non-Christian religions are of the devil, and that those who follow those false religions will not be saved. People need to be converted to the true faith of Christ, the Catholic faith, in order to be saved. Here's what the Catholic Church teaches. Pope Paul III, quote, Man, according to the testimony of the sacred scriptures, has been created to enjoy eternal life and happiness, which none may obtain save through faith in our Lord Jesus Christ, end quote. As the Apostolic Father St. Polycarp said, Everyone who does not confess that Jesus Christ has come in the flesh is an antichrist. Whoever does not confess the testimony of the cross is of the devil. And whoever perverts the saying of the Lord for his own desires and says that there is neither resurrection nor judgment, such a one is the firstborn of Satan. The Council of Trent. So unless they were born again in Christ, they never would be justified. It also declared, Our Catholic faith, without which it is impossible to please God. Hebrews 11.6 The First Vatican Council. This true Catholic faith, outside of which no one can be saved. Pope Innocent III defined as a dogma. There is indeed one universal church of the faithful, outside of which no one at all is saved. Pope Eugene IV, the Council of Florence. But it is also necessary for eternal salvation that he faithfully believe in the incarnation of our Lord Jesus Christ. Pope Pius VIII. Against these experienced sophists, the people must be taught that the profession of the Catholic faith is uniquely true, as the Apostle proclaims, one Lord, one faith, one baptism. Indeed, no other name than the name of Jesus is given to men by which they may be saved. He who believes shall be saved, he who does not believe shall be condemned. Pope Gregory the Sixteenth, with the admonition of the Apostle that there is one God, one faith, one baptism, may those fear who contrive the notion that the safe harbor of salvation is open to persons of any religion whatever. They should consider the testimony of Christ himself that those who are not with Christ are against him, and that they disperse unhappily who do not gather with him. Therefore, without a doubt, they will perish forever unless they hold the Catholic faith whole and inviolate. Pope Gregory the Sixteenth, quoting Pope St. Gregory the Great, also declared concerning the dogma outside the church there is no salvation, quote, The holy universal church teaches that it is not possible to worship God truly except in her, and asserts that all who are outside of her will not be saved. Official acts of the church proclaim the same dogma. Pope Eugene the Fourth defined ex cathedra. The Holy Roman Church firmly believes, professes, and preaches that all those who are outside the Catholic Church, not only pagans, but also Jews or heretics and schismatics, cannot share an eternal life and will go into the everlasting fire which was prepared for the devil and his angels, unless they are joined to the Church before the end of their lives, and that nobody can be saved, no matter how much he has given away in alms, and even if he has shed blood in the name of Christ, unless he has persevered in the bosom and unity of the Catholic Church.